Hi everybody, it's Richard again here from Electric Classic Cars and today's video is going to be a little bit different because we've hit 100,000 subscribers which is amazing. So thanks everybody for subscribing and watching because uh, we didn't think we'd get to 100,000 subscribers certainly this quickly. So from everybody at Spud Productions, from me, from Spud, yeah, say hello. There's, there's, say hello Spud, say thank you very much. Hello! And from Tim beyond the camera, hello. a massive thank you for watching. So today's video is going to be a little bit different. We're going to have kind of a, a montage, if you like, a greatest hits of reactions for, from people driving my cars and our creations, from crazy cars like this Tesla powered Land Rover Defender and my Tesla powered Beetle here. We've got people like Paddy McGuinness on BBC Top Gear and YouTube stars like Matt Watson on Car Wow and Johnny Smith and Robert Llewellyn and all those guys. Their reactions are just so fantastic. When they initially put their foot down in my cars, I thought, let's make a greatest hits montage of like their reactions. So thanks not only to you guys, the viewers for watching, but also those guys for allowing us to use their footage. And just before we roll the tape, I just wanted to say a big thanks also to all your comments because we love engaging with you guys and we do read all the comments and we try to answer as many as possible. So in this video, I want to ask you guys, which is your favorite clip of what's to come? So on that note, roll the tape. Nothing encourages ultimate performance more than a competition. And what better? than to race a 204 miles per hour petrol supercar. <laughs> I know it's posh and I know it's fast. It's not just fast, it's bloody fast. So we're gonna have a race. Try and put this job into context just to see how the Beetle shapes up against a well-proven hypercar. And I think it'll be tight. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Man, it is on the Donkey Kong. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I will say three, two, one, go. And you both go on the G of the go. So please stand by. Three, two, one, go. That beetle is so fast. All right, boss. Yeah, I picked him. Just. Hey! <laughs> the start is depressing because I just see you tearing off. Making no noise. No noise. And then I'm like making all this noise and racket <laughs> and stuff like that. As long as it's long enough, I can catch you. But it was amazing. <laughs> you know, if you can take a beetle and make it that quick, the future of hot rodding is definitely in safe hands. <laughs> Specialist Tom in gear here. I'm just going to floor the throttle, see what we get. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, crap! <laughs> 3 .95. <laughs> Let's do it again. Right, here we go. <laughs> now let's just drive it sensibly. <laughs> I'm dribbling down my face. <laughs> it's got the wind and just the hilarity of it. Well, you do get blown about quite a bit, not having any <laughs> roof on, which is fine when it's dry like it is at the moment, but if it rains, not so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. This is so much fun. Oh, I'd like one of these. Whenever you're ready. Let's give it three, a go. Two, one. Five point nine! Five point nine! Yay! 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 <laughs> 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 
<laughs> <laughs> That's just that is smiles per mile. The most ridiculous car, <laughs> but the most stunning car at the same time. You must be delighted with it. Uh, yeah, I'm, I am chuffed. Um, it's just the grin factor. My face hurts now a bit. Yeah, it's, it, it's, it's everything I wanted out of a Mini, really. Yeah. Uh, it feels like an original Mini. And um, it's it, just it got handles the power. brilliantly. Yeah. You know, the people, oh, electric cars are too heavy, they don't handle. That just, it turns in brilliantly. You don't feel the weight at all because it's not got any extra weight, really. No, no. Um, those 0 to 60 tests, I'm sure if there was just one person in the car, that's a sub five and a half seconds. I reckon with the right conditions, you'd get below five seconds. In. I reckon you could bit just technique, possibly. Bit of yeah, I think it's a bit of practice and may even be a bit of tweaking with the Tesla and the traction yeah. control. Might, might just, but you know, I think we're on the limit of the tyres. So I've done a few of Moggy's conversions. I've driven his Beetle. Yeah. That's Pretty epic, a 600 horsepower. I drove the 308 Ferrari. Yeah. But that, <laughs> that's the one I want to take home, mate. So what you're looking at here is a professional driver at the controls of one of the most impressive vehicles on the roads. This is the Ferrari 308, and this is fully charged. <laughs> so this is, I'm going to admit this, quite frightening, because uh, obviously this is an amazing car. It was, uh, it was around a, a 200 horsepower when it was a combustion vehicle. It is now over 500. That is a little bit frightening. So Richard, who converted this, Richard, who's been on the show in the past many times uh, with various converted classic cars, he did uh, send me a text and an email to say, uh, it's a bit lively and don't drive it in the wet and a light right foot is needed. And he's absolutely right because it, it can do this. Oh! The stats on this thing are bonkers. They're crazy. This goes further on a charge than the original car went on a tank of petrol. It's faster, it's lighter, it accelerates quicker. <laughs> I'm good, right? Let's do this, because I'm freezing. Delay things to make you even colder. <laughs> Just a bloody hurry up. Okay, we'll get up to 30 miles an hour. I'll count it in, so that's 20. 30 miles an hour, right. Come on. One, go! Whoa! <laughs> bloody hell! <laughs> <laughs> this thing makes a noise! <laughs> His eyes were warring, my nose is running! <laughs> My bum's on fire, Matt. I forgot about the heated seats. I feel like I wet myself. How are you feeling over there, mate? My teeth are actually chattering already. <laughs> Can we swap back, please? <laughs> Can your fingers even move and touch the radio or what? <laughs> Matt, that's the funniest thing I've ever seen. I was laughing my head off looking at you then. Get Jeez. out. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank for that. Okay, here we go. 20 miles an hour. Ready? This is how this Defender accelerates. My word. <laughs> In fact, Richard at Electric Classic Cars has clocked this doing 0 to 60 in around four seconds. Four seconds. It's driving my throat out. Bearing in mind, 0 to 62 in four and a half seconds is an Aston Martin DBX or even a G-Wagon G63 AMG. You can feel that the weight is all really low. It doesn't want to lollop like a lot of defenders do. It doesn't feel like a, you know, a drunk rugby player. 
It's certainly no V8 or V6, but one thing is for sure. When you've got this kind of power on tap, the addiction is in the, the swell of the torque. Watch this. <laughs> it's an animal. It's an absolute bloody animal. Wow. <laughs> that looked wicked. Richard, that looked amazing. That burnout was wicked because it was silent. <laughs> Sorry, your tyres are cooling down. I better do mine quickly. Three, two, one. Oh, it's close. Oh, this is so close. Come on, 911. Oh, here we go. That's more like it. I'm pulling him back. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Go, 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 go! Oh. Oh. Okay, Rich. Um, I make it one each. Best two out of three. Go on, there, mate. Do you want to swap? Yeah. I'll have a go in yours. Yeah, yeah. Why not? Let's do it. Let's swap cars. All right, Richard. Um, listen, your car is absolutely tiny inside and I've got nowhere to put my walkie-talkie or even my mic. Do you just hold things between your legs by your balls? Not with me, mate. There's not enough room between my legs. <laughs> Fortunately, there is between mine, but oh well. <laughs> right. Do you mind if I warm up your tyres? I'm going to do it in yours anyway. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I'm laughing like a sea. I was like, ar, ar, ar. <laughs> oh my god, that's nuts! Right then, Rich, this is the decider. I know this is your car and you probably want it to win, but you've got to make sure you launch properly in that Porsche. You want this to be a fair race. You got it? I got it, mate. This isn't my car, so I'm going to thrash the nuts off it. That's the story of my life, though. <laughs> right, let's do this. Come on. Three, two, <laughs> Neck and neck off the line. Oh. oh! Oh, I saw that. When he changed gear, this thing had gone because it's just constant power! God, that's close. Oh, that was interesting. Great launch, so close between the two of us. But as you change from either first to second or second to third, this just has constant power. Constant power! I just took you, but then you were coming back at the end. It's the gear changes where I lose. Uh, every time a gear change happens, it literally goes back about a meter. And the interesting thing is, that seven speed dual clutch automatic is one of the fastest changing automatics in the world ever. Uh, maybe, but it's, no, it's, no, it's not as fast as an electric motor with no gears, is it? No, no, good point, well made. Anyway, that was a lot of fun. I love this car. It's completely berserk. <laughs> I reckon you should do a, a real big, massive, smoky burnout in this and just destroy the tyres for the uh, YouTube. Did you hear that? So he wants me to go in his car and destroy the tyres for him, for you guys. Shall I? Is it? All right, what are we going to do? There's two of us in the car. What's happening? We're we going for a nice leisurely drive. <laughs> <laughs> no. Have you packed the picnic? No. We're going to we are to close in here, though, aren't we? We are, isn't it? It's really? almost like we're spooning. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <we're missing. laughs> are we going to uh, destroy the, what's left of the tyres, mate? So, okay. Uh, All right. How do we do that? Well, there's only one way to do it. Massive burnout. So we've got a line lock in this. Okay. So what that is, it's essentially that holds the brake pressure on the front axle, and then you can uh, take your foot off the brake, but it holds it, and then you floor it. So the rear's light up, but the front brakes are on. Okay. Okay, so I'll do all that. All you have to do is floor it. I can do that. And hold your breath when the smoke starts coming in. Yeah, I can do that as well. So let's let's try it. <laughs> oh my God. Here we it's go. like a smoke machine. Can't see where we're going. Ready, steady. Yeah, go. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 big slides! 
<laughs> oh my god! It is! Look at that, it's wicked! Can you check if the tyres are road legal, please? There's enough tread left, Nick. Can you just have a look at them? Let's have a look. It'll, it'll be like slicks. Do you look at that? That is insane. Look at this! Look at this! <laughs> look at that! Look at that! The tyres are actually road legal still, I think. That's cup twos for you. They're very, very strong tyres. Defender. Defender. Whoa. Oh, look at it go. That defender off the line. Good lord. I have just literally left a Porsche for dead in a Land Rover Defender. Can you imagine just someone pulling up at the side of you at the lights, thinking, oh, I'll burn this off, and you're like, will you? <laughs> That's the most fun I've had Anything. ever. It, Aston Martin Victors, Sorry. Ferrari Romas, DB5s, this, for that first five seconds, was bonkers. <laughs> <laughs>